Hey, what's up guys? It's Chuck from Brady Adventures. And if you have a first gen Tacoma, you know about the problems with the plastic seat trim that goes on the side of the seat. Getting in and out, the rear end is gonna hit that plastic and it's only held on by a couple little plastic clips and a single screw. They almost always crack and break off. On our first gen Tacoma, it didn't have a plastic cover at all. So I just ordered up one of those covers. We're gonna open it up and take a look. And here it is, right here. So you can see on this, there's a little clip, um, something that sits in the bracket, and a couple little teeny clips that just sort of line it up, and that is it. Over time, it flexes and stresses, and then this thing cracks and breaks. Look, and the other thing I got is the back panel trim cover, and when Mackenzie sits in the back, her head, cracks on this piece of metal. That and this, because it hurts my head when I go like that. She is gonna be thrilled about me getting this piece. <laughs> now put your head, how's it feel? It feels comfy. Yeah, is it good? Yeah. Good surprise? <laughs> Before I ordered this, I was really interested if anyone had created a replacement for these or something would keep them from breaking again and again and again. Uh, especially after you raise the vehicle. I heard once you do a lift, this is higher, so your rear end's actually gonna hit it more often. And poking around on Tacoma World, I ran into Mechanic John, and I ordered these brackets. I got a really good review from people. And here they are, passenger side, driver side. The idea behind these metal brackets is gonna fit down in here and provide additional screw points for this plastic and provide this metal reinforcing. And this will actually keep this piece right here, which is where the braking happens, from flexing. These things come with everything you need. Sack of bolts for the passenger and for the driver. And it looks like maybe some instructions in here. Let's take a look. The instructions that come with it are basically showing you how to stack the washers and bolt the bracket. And in addition to these, on YouTube, Mechanic John has a couple videos of part one and two. Uh, part one shows you how to get these brackets on, and then part two, how to get the screws in to attach in a couple additional places. Now, Mechanic John says if these are not broke, that really this is gonna provide enough support, and so far it feels like it will. Um, if they're already cracked and flexing um, a little bit, then that's when you want to put the additional screws in. Um, I'll put links to Mechanic John's videos in the description and a link over to Tacoma World where he has the information on the brackets and how you can get in touch with them to order them. Keep an eye out in our next video. We'll be installing these into the Tacoma and show you exactly what you need to do to get them in there and get it all hooked up. I'm sure you guys have lots of other questions. Please leave those in the comments. We'd be happy to answer any of them. And thanks again for watching Brady Adventures.